Hey bros, Muscle Panda. I'm going to be talking about Ostrine and Anadrine or S4. So, I've only done cutting cycles with both of these. The S4 wasn't a bigger stack, and the Ostrine was typically only ever put with Cardrine. So, a couple things. I find Ostrine and Cardrine to work very well together. This is not medical, legal, or any other type of advice. This video is made for entertainment purposes only. Visit pandastrength.com. And then S4 and Cardrine also work very well together. Um, I did them both in calorie deficits. With the Cardrine cycle, I did a lot of cardio and weightlifting. In the S4 cycle, I pretty much slacked on everything. But they were both deficits. And the deficit was about the same, give or take. And I would have to say the S4 outdid the O string easily. I did like no cardio basically with the S4 and I lost like 14 pounds, I think in like four weeks or something. And that was significant considering even with the O string, I can't remember exactly how much I lost because I've used O string so many times. But I definitely had to work my ass off to lose any weight with the Ostrine because just taking the Ostrine and Cardrine with no real cardio involved just doesn't have as good of results as if you have cardio. And that's with everything. Like I'm sure I would have lost significantly more weight with the S4 if I did more cardio or any cardio because I didn't really do cardio. Here's the catch. S4 had hella side effects. It's not really hella as in a lot, they were just extreme. As you may know, the eye thing with the S4 causes the yellowing. And that is an understatement. The yellowing didn't really matter to me. Because it, it would be like, like how I'm wearing sunglasses in a fucking basement. Like if you had like yellow tinted sunglasses, that's how it was with S4. Not all the time, just some of the time. The problem was is maybe about like three quarters of the way through the cycle. And like maybe like week three or four. All of a sudden, I couldn't like use my devices. I couldn't watch TV. I couldn't look at my phone. My eyes would not focus. And if I strained my eyes to try to stare at the screen, I would get really bad headaches. So somehow the S4 was messing with like the cones and rods in my eyes. And so I may or may not ever try S4 again. I put up a different video saying that I would never do it again. So S4 was definitely stronger and more potent and had better results, but Ostrine had basically no side effects. So I would have to say Ostrine wins, generally speaking, between the two. If you want to take the risk of basically going temporarily fucking blind and not being able to like do shit with your eyes, try S4. Or don't. I would not recommend it. I would not. It was horrible. You don't understand. It was painstakingly horrible. Like driving was out of the question. I couldn't fucking see. If you can't see, you can't drive. If you can't see, you can't do a lot of things. And it just really sucked. So definitely Ostrine is the winner. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Comment below what you think. Visit my blog. Do your thing.